Okay, so for this example here, this is really an example that you should pause now and try it out yourself, conjecture it and see what you can do, and then compare what you've come up with with what I've done. And, um, because it's really about you conjecturing something. But this is what I would do. I would take minus 5 plus 8i, and it says to multiply it by its conjugate, which is minus 5 minus 8i. And what I recognize here is that this is a difference of squares. Remember if I would do this scenario here, the middle term is negative. I can just go through and go x squared minus 9. And so here I'm going to multiply it out and I get minus, uh, I get 25 and then a minus 64 i squared, excuse me which is going to be 25 plus 64 because negative 1 times a negative and so I get then 89 and so if I'm going to conjecture a formula for this well this process is going to work all the time so it would be a plus b i times a minus b i and if I go z times the z conjugate I believe I'm going to get a squared plus b squared, whatever I get for that. And if it's negative, I just make sure that those values here are squared, so that negative 5 would be squared to get a positive value in the end. And this is what I believe the formula is.